the public I know, but, but what do we know about what happened today? And Aaron, this was at a first appearance that lasted all of five or six minutes. The judge ruling today that Alyssa would be held without bail, excuse me, as expected. Uh, the defendant in court wearing that uh, jail smock, a white face cloth. I went to Kentucky Fried Chicken uh, when I was I first got my license, like 17 years old or 70, 80, whatever it was. And I'm driving, I think my dad's. Just for Laughs presents The Masters. Great performances from Jimmy Carr at the world's biggest comedy festival. Here's Jimmy Carr. Oh, well, good evening. I'm Jimmy Carr, and these are my jokes. <laughs> I tell you what I love, 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 and I bet you all love it too. Do you love the snooze button? Russ, my 100 million reached that goal last week. We're told he's now going to double that. Um, so he'll have an announcement there and other investments um, in government funding to try to deal with inequities in vaccinations in rural communities and minority communities. And based on income level, there'll be some announcements there. And then he's just going to face a barrage of questions on the border, everything from, from there to the economy, he's supposed to roll out some new economic proposals potentially next week, and then foreign policy on North Korea, on whether he's going to maintain U.S. troops in Afghanistan past this May 1st deadline. So a lot is there to ask the president. We'll see how many questions he takes. But as you noted, it's, uh, it's been a while since he's held one of—he has not held one of these— has napped their way to the gold medal in synchronized napping. Coming up, the final rounds of boxing, plus a special message from volleyball legend Gabrielle Reese. So don't go away.